Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. It's Jay, and today we're going to be playing The Butcher. We're going to be using his hamstring build, which focuses on OTKing a character when you get to them. So today on our team is going to be The Butcher, Diva, Nazebo, Junkrat, and Genji, against Jaina, Hanzo, Valera, Murky, and Sonya, and we're going to be on Towers of Doom. Now the videos are going to be coming out earlier today, because I have stuff to do later, so... I want to make sure I at least get two videos out a day. Every day. Again, don't forget guys, uh, links are in the description. Follow me on Twitter, Instagram, on Twitch. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. And leave feedback. Or if you guys just want to be in the next video. I have no problem doing that. Alright, let's see if this game loads. Lately, I've had some pretty bad luck with some bad teams. You can get anyone to work together. Alright, so for the first talent, is going to be Invigoration. To increase, to decrease the mana cost and the skill cooldown. Uh, you want to complete fresh meat. It's like a necessary thing. Or not, you're never going to end up getting the kill. Don't be confused just because the Butcher's big, it does not mean he's a tanky character. Actually, he's very squishy and can be killed extremely easily. Well, it seems like we have a new a new player on our team, the D.Va. That was a crazy shot. Uh, of course, Valera. I do not like going against Valera. Genji, what, what was that, Genji? He body -bombed. I think I might. And we have... An AFK Junkrat. I guess like collecting meat is very important. I'm actually just gonna rotate pot so I can uh, get meat. Seems like a drunk rat came back. Again, completing this quest is extremely important and XP is very important. You don't want to, you know, lag behind the enemy team. Because if they get the heroics or storm talents before you do, uh, you're at a disadvantage. Diva, you're our tank. You're our tank. Thank you, Diva. She needs to get out of there. Oh, she had left. Now she's back. A body block, me, Diva. Gotta get that. Uh, I gotta back out. Back out, back out, back out. Oh, uh, for this one, you wanna go. What is this level four? Frail axe to increase the length. Yes, we see that Genji. And Diva left again. He was back. Oh wait, I wasn't. I could. I think I could have killed them. Oh no, I misclicked an attack by accident. When you die, you lose, you lose fresh meat. 
his Steve was actually doing a lot of damage somehow. Sadly, I wasn't able to collect that meat, but I should be able to get more. Focus, focus on Valera. There you go. Uh, actually, Genji could easily kill. Yeah. How we haven't gotten this, and I don't think we can. Yeah, we weren't able to get it. We're pretty even. I do really need to complete this quest. They're all down here. Which is auto attack makes or breaks him. Uh, for this one, we're going to go increase movement speed while enemies are branded, just to make sure that you can chase and that they can't escape. Uh, you can see me rotating from lane to lane because I don't want to get caught out of position while trying to get me. Yeah, this new Zebo isn't as hard as we thought. Yep, got him. Uh, I'm surprised he- did he drop me? I didn't see. Junkrat should actually be a good partner for me, because I think if I get someone low enough, he could just take the kill, which is fine. Keeping an eye on the minimap, because I want to know where Valera is. Almost halfway done with this, uh... He got it? I didn't even see the objective. We gotta get out of here. That is an incredible amount of slow and... Junkrat, 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 help me! Oh my god, no freaking way. There was no way I made that out alive. What? See, they got their level 10s. We need to focus on... Uh, Keeping our XP and I need to increase my thing. I'm gonna go Furnace Blast because you get up close and personal with them. The Valera on this team is extremely dangerous. I just realized I haven't seen Diva in a while. That was actually a very good engagement. Someone needs to uh, take the thing. My team was not paying attention, were they? Go back out. Wow. 
wow, that slow is ridiculous. But I'm almost done with the quest. Actually, I should be. I should have finished it earlier. But I have to get this. I have to come and get this meat. Have to come and get it. Come on, butcher, move, move them legs, those stubby little legs. Okay, I'm almost done with this talent. Once you finish the talent, you don't lose it any you don't lose the, the meat anymore when you die. Tap the fountain real quick. Again, as you can see the bush is really squishy. Oh, that was mine. Okay. Uh, for this one, you're going to go this level 13. Brutal Strike. After you do this, the next basic attacks, or the next three basic attacks deal extra damage. As you can see, when you actually do this, the next basic attack happens immediately. So you basically do a, uh, a bunch of damage in a short amount of time. We're pretty even. You know, not everyone's died. Sadly, I think I have the worst stats on the team. Butcher is not a character that I play often. But this should be a good enough uh, example on how. Wow, that was a lot of damage on Genji. Nope, I wasn't able to get it. See Valera, she's over there. Yeah, she's been coming in and out of the game. We should, yeah, defend the boss. <clears throat> because if they take it, then uh, we're gonna be even more behind. Oh. Okay. messed up on that. Forgot to click my Q. Oh, that was a good hit. You see how I'm staying behind? Because he's very, very squishy. I'm actually going to go defend the top part. The top tower. Yes, let the altars rise! Yeah, you do not want to lose these, because that means they get an extra damage every time they shoot a tower. Apparently Murky does drop the, the meat, so that's good. I'm gonna try to get a sneaky sneaky tower. Yeah, we have to get this. Okay, so we got it. Oh, I did 
not see him there. I gotta get away, get away, kill him. Thank you. That, that actually saved my life. Alright, so for the 16th talent, you're gonna go in rage, gain attack speed, and armor at low HP. So that means I can stay in the fight a little bit longer. to help diva gotta keep an eye out for valera valera is extremely dangerous now I'll show them. hopefully this uh this diva is able to strain out her connection lay claim to the altars do not disappoint me. Yeah, okay, we should be able to get that one. Oh, that slow is so much. Okay, so they're all dead, so we should be able to get this. You can see, look at that bonus attack. It's 240. That is incredible. By the way, you see this? This was in rage. Uh, it's not an active ability. It is a passive, so you don't worry about clicking on it. because I tried to save D.Va. Pop, 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 pop. No, I died. Yeah, I tried to save D.Va. And I was a little late to the fight. Actually, we should have gone for boss at that point. You can't take on Sonya. Get out of there. And... Again, after you complete the quest, you don't lose this anymore. So I'm keeping the 240 bonus damage. See, attack damage is 540 per hit. Yeah, this Nazebo hasn't been pushing the forts. If we lose all of them, we start taking damage over time. See? Yeah, there's... I couldn't do anything for him. We just gotta take back a tower. And they have their storm talents. I don't know what this... Nazebo was doing. Yeah. They're just gonna keep the towers while we take damage over time. Well, or 20 talent, go either way. You could go uh, Bolt Storm to teleport a short distance, or you can go basic attack slow. I'll go for that one because I don't want them running away. Yeah, this Nazebo never pushed the towers and kept pressure on them, and that's why they've been able to uh, push us down. The altars will be ours. I have died the most. No, Diva has. But that's because she has a mech suit. Yeah, there's no way we're winning this game. But at least it was a good example on, on the build. No. It's mostly hamstring and auto attack. You just do your marks. The altars stand ready. Capture them before the Raven Lord's pawns do. 
Now they got the tower. Well, that's GG. Hopefully, the build. Hopefully, you guys have a better game than I did with the build. But it's easy enough to do if you remember to stay back because this charge thing has a, a very big range. Alright everybody, uh, don't forget to comment, like, subscribe, uh, links are in the description, and I'll see you guys next time.